Get junkies, or take monkeys, or let's get funky with some honky tonky Rosewell. Hey, what's up, guys? Elric here on the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel. We're bringing you all the tech all the freaking time. And this time, we're giving away some stuff. That's right. That's what this is all about. And I'm just going to say up front, I apologize to the person who's supposed to get this in the prize, but son, I'm going to unbox it. <gasps> now, you're going to win it, but I'm going to have to take that bad boy out and get it naked. So that's just going to have to happen here. So anyways, I got these uh, three things up here on top. These are about $15 a piece. Now, I hold up the camera can see them. These are a handy notebook accessory kit, which anybody who has a laptop can actually use. These are all the runner-up prizes. Now, in this box back behind me, well, actually to the side of me, I guess it is, this is the Rosewill Hercules 1600 watt power supply. So listen, do any of you guys know who Hercules was? All right, check this out. There was this dude with an ego complex, thought he was a god, called himself Zeus. All right, maybe, you know, he was a god, I wasn't there. But anyways, he, you know, slipped around and, you know, he banged this one human girl. Name escapes me right now, you know, and, um, well, they had a child and his name was, you know, Hercules, you know, and he was like the baddest, meanest, strongest, you know, basically he was the kick-ass guy, you know, of the family. You know the story, gods came down, they tried to cause some problems, he stuck with the humans. You guys have all seen the movies, it's history, man. If not, check out the movies, they're actually pretty cool, some special effects. But I'm rambling, so let's take this stuff right here. I'm going to take it now and sit it down. Gently, gently! I'm what, gently? All right, now check it out. Big box right here. Now this thing, folks, weighs a fracking ton. That's right, it weighs a fracking ton. I mean, serious, this thing's heavy as hell. It's 400 bucks. I mean, it's basically an incredibly powerful power supply. Now, I'm just wondering, because like here in America, we do not have power that goes up to 1600 watts. So it must taper off at, you know, at uh, what our maximum is. And uh, I'm thinking that's so. Now, oh, wow, this is actually, you you guys are lucky, man. This thing's going to be badass. You guys are in for a treat now. Check this out. This is the first ever that I've seen this. Power supply that comes in a fracking metal box. Maybe others have done it, but man, check this out. Boom. Metal box. Kabam. Look at this thing. It's like getting a freaking treasure chest, man. I feel like I'm just like a... I can't say that in the movie, the Pirates of the Something, you know, because i got a little treasure chest right here. And look, it goes multiple directions. This is like trippy. It's kind of like you know, almost, almost, honestly, kind of like something you use for like a, a high-end power amp. I think I'm looking at a Marshall stack. All right, so, all right, folks. So now check it out. I'm about to open this thing up. I'm gonna pop the top here. Ba boom. Now check this out. It's completely padded inside of here. There's even cloth inside of here to protect it. Check this out. Rosewell felt cloth. That's pretty damn cool stuff. And so let's get in here. Now, semi-modular power supply, obviously. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this bad boy out. We'll just take a look at this. Hercules 1600 watt. Holy crap, Batman, right? That's what I'm saying. So flip it around right here. Now, obviously, this thing is going to support any type of stuff you want. I sure the hell hope so. With 600 watts, it should be supporting quad SLI, quad crossfire, quad uh, people crossing their eyes. I mean, hell, it should do a lot. So let's flip it around the back here. We can see, let's see, let me get this better for you guys. Okay, so here we go. There you can see the back of it. All the PCIEs right there in the red. All the SATA and the rest right here. Hard drive, SATA, floppy, all power down here. PCIE all up there. Power all right here. You got your 24 pin here. Got a bunch of uh, dual four pins. 8-pin, you got all the stuff you need for the power on your motherboard right here. So these are all for your peripherals. So show you guys the other side just real quick. So once again, the name. And in the very back, you can see right here, fan control. And look at this. They have protection on the power switch. Now, folks, I'm going to tell you why they have this on here. Um, I've asked this a lot before, and I've complained to companies. I'm like, hey, 
why doesn't your high-end power supply have an on and off switch? And they're telling me it's because it's actually dangerous to turn the power supply off by the button like that if it's plugged in like this. So that's why it's like that. It's actually better to try to shut this thing off if you have the wall control, like into one of those switches. Shut it off there first before you even mess with this whatsoever. So let's get this out of the way. Here we've got the Hercules 80 plus silver. User's manual. At 1600 watts, um, you know, having uh, silver plus is pretty damn good because you've got a lot of power there. So if it's constantly running even 1400 watts, you're kicking ass. Bang the stuff out of here. Sorry, guy. I don't mean to like tear your little box up here. All right. So, wow. Here we go. Look at this. All of the cables are in there. Holy macaroni, Juni Juni. All right. So, you guys want to see them? I'll try not to bore you too damn much with these. So, I'm not going to go anal on this. Okay, folks. Power supply. Power cord right there. Molex. Floppy. SATA. SATA. Lots of it. For your video cards and the rest. Tons and tons of six and eight pin connections here. Enough to do, yes. Dun 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 dun. For video cards. Oh my. Look at that. All right, folks, so there you have it. Now, I've seen a box like this one time in the past before. Back in the past, AMD sent me a video card, and it was actually a box like this that said AMD. It was a bit different, but kind of similar. This one's actually even cooler. Now, one thing that's great is that somebody out there gets to win this. And yes, before you even ask, it's worldwide. Now, here's where I know somebody's going to come in, they're going to start throwing their bananas, their pieces of fruit, be going like this. <laughs> You know, trying to trying to avoid it, you know, but you're going to have to uh, Facebook it, baby. That's right. This is a Facebook contest giveaway, whatever the heck you want to call it. How do you win? OK, well, check it out. It's Friday, February the 15th, the day after Valentine's Day. So love me, baby. And all you have to do is go over to our Facebook page and the Facebook page of Roseville and just go over there and like the page and then we're going to pick winners from there that's right so there'll be four winners it's international and so all you got to do is go like the facebook page it doesn't hurt you just hit a button it's not like that's painful it doesn't cost you anything or hurt you anything and then we're going to pick the winner i'll send you out a message from facebook as well i'm going to announce it on facebook but i will contact you directly this time as well because lately there's been a lot of people that don't claim stuff and i wait months and i wait and i send you guys stuff and you still don't do anything so i will contact you directly as well so this thing will be posted and announced on march the 2nd of 2013. that's right this year not next year i thought about doing this next year because i'm <laughs> Now, way too long. Anyways, all right, guys. I hope you guys like this. It's always just a great opportunity to win some free stuff. And this is pretty bad ad stuff. So please like the video. Show me the love. And I'll see you guys back here on the channel. If you're not subscribed, hey, make sure you are so that you get our stuff in your inbox. And you know just what's going on on Tech of Tomorrow.